Good morning. Uh, today is Monday, August the 7th. The time right now in Singapore is 8.37 in the morning. Over the last six weeks or so, we can see that crude oil prices has been moving a lot higher. We can see the market actually hit a high uh, this morning at $83.80 uh, per barrel in the WTI. Now, this level is actually very crucial, technically speaking, because in uh, mid-April, we can see prices actually uh, was trading at a high of $83.84. So this morning high so far has briefly brushed against this level. And in energy markets, it is actually quite common for the market to bridge either a swing high or a swing low and then reverses direction. So this is probably one of those. And uh, the fact, of course, the market has been fundamentally been supported by a, the two largest oil producers, Saudi Arabia, extending its production cut all the way from August uh, to September. And of course, uh, Russia also coordinated this move by also slashing production cut by $300,000 uh, barrels a day uh, in September. So both actually uh, supported oil prices uh, last week itself. And uh, we can see that the market is already brushing against a key swing high that I mentioned at $83.84. I suspect we probably would do a false move as the market try one more time to take out this level and then reverse this direction. So do, do look out for the possibility. However, the market actually closed below $81.77 this uh, by today, then the reversal will be in place. And I do expect the market to actually drift back to $74 thereabout. And this is actually my outlook for the day itself. So look out for this potential move by crude oil faking a move to the upside and then reverses direction. There I have it for you. So in the meantime, uh, I'll come back to you tomorrow with another update. Bye-bye. Take care.